It took a lot of work behind the scenes to keep the annual Atlantic Rally for Cruisers in St. Lucia. But the general manager of Rodney Bay Marina, Cuthbert Didier, says it was worth it. World Cruising Club and the Marina signed a one-year deal for the 2008 ARC, but its future here remained uncertain. Didier says what caused the Rodney Bay Marina to retain the ARC was the major upgrades to the facilities now underway. Apart from the docks, we will have an improvement in the showers and we're going to be working on certain aesthetics in terms of the entrance and security. So all in all, World Cruising Club is very, very pleased and Andrew Bishop has shown that by extending the contract for another four years. Didier says tourism officials had a major part to play in the extension. He noted the work of the Tourist Board and the Ministry of Tourism in securing the new contract. Didier says St. Lucia is the envy of the yachting fraternity, especially in this part of the region. It means again greater marketing focus in the European markets. Uh, the race starts from Las Palmas as we know. And every year we have a huge contingency in terms of European um, entries. So it's, it means a lot in terms of marketing the yachting product, marketing St. Lucia. It also means great potential villa sales because um, on average a lot, about 20% of the ARC participants who come there here in St. Lucia explore the purchase of buying villas and condos. The Rodney Bay Marina manager was excited about the development, which he thinks will only be a positive for the island. This is excellent news for not just the yachting community of, in St. Lucia, but also all St. Lucians involved in the tourism product and all St. Lucians in all other sectors. Already we have 225 vessels registering for this year's ARC and a waiting list of another 20. So by all indications, St. Lucia is definitely the home of the Atlantic Rally for Cruisers. Expansion work is now underway at the marina. Plans are in place for the handing over of the floating docks on September 1st. And Didier says already, the arc slips are secure. Clinton Reynolds, HDS News, Channel 4.